Australian visa changes in the federal budget. What we know so far, Labor has promised to fix visa processing times and make changes to Australia's humanitarian program, with new details now revealed in the federal budget of 25th October. Here's what we know so far. The government is committed to ensuring Australia has the right skills to support our economy and drive future growth. This includes responsibly using migration to ease current critical skill and labor shortages, which have been impacting the everyday lives of Australians. The permanent migration program will be expanded to 195,000 in 2022 23 This is an increase of 35,000. More than 90% of new places will be for skilled migrants, and more than a quarter targeted to regional areas. To address skills shortages more quickly, additional funding of $42.2 million will be provided to accelerate visa processing, in addition to the earlier $36.1 million to hire up to 500 people for nine months to help address wait times, reduce the visa backlog, and raise awareness of opportunities for high-skilled migrants in Australia's permanent migration program. Student and secondary training visa holders will have their work restrictions relaxed until 30 June 2023. This will allow them to work additional hours in any sector, helping to address workforce shortages. The government will scale up the aged care training pathway for the Pacific Australia Labor Mobility Scheme with an additional 500 places in 2022-23. If you are asking if more visas will become available, yes. The government has already increased the permanent migration program from 160,000 visa places to 195,000 in 2022-23. This includes visas available for skilled migrants and family members.